So Rising OS 2.1 is back with another new update and it's now officially available for some of the supported devices and by the way see if it is available for your device or not you can check out the support link which is available in the description with this new update as uh, this is having the latest security patch by the way as you can see 5th of april 2024 which is quite good some of the features are missing from this update yeah, as compared to the last one although some very useful and interesting customizations features are there so let's get started let's find out some of the things which are included here and make sure to watch this video till the end video could be quite interesting for you moving on to some of the changes which we have for example if you move on to the wallpaper section you will see some interesting wallpapers are included like for example we have nothing to a wallpapers are included so in case you don't know you want to try out nothing to a wallpapers these are included by default you can use them and apply them on your device this is another new collection and some of the wallpapers look quite good by the way this second one which i have applied already looks interesting one first one if you are a dark mode user then you can try out this one we have pixel 8a wallpapers are included too i guess i think so these are available we have rising os rising os 2.0 the wallpapers which i already shown you a lot of time ago actually these are also present some pixel super fans edition so yes in the terms of wallpapers there are many wallpapers available we have nothing wallpapers we have mid journey rising beauty and a lot more things in a collection second most interesting thing what i found right now is the ios style lock screen and it is not with a depth effect wallpaper but just if you apply ios style clock in the lock screen you will see these widgets and this is looking super interesting you can also change it it's available we have many options already available i tried ios style it was looking so good you can also try oxygen os style ios style is already good because with the widgets which are pre-installed are looking super good here and you can try any other widget any other lock screen clock a lot of custom clock styles are available and i'm not saying this is a unique feature because it's available in some other custom rooms too but yes it is available in this custom room so i just wanted to let you know Moving on to some of the widgets here which you can apply on a device. We have two options for the big widgets. For example, if I try these two widgets here, they, they, let me show you. I just applied them, open my lock screen here. You can see these two widgets are here just below the lock screen clock, the one which you have applied. For example, I applied this one. You can choose other mini widgets too, approximately four mini widgets which you can apply on a device. And it depends upon you which thing you want to choose. By the way, one thing which is, which is missing from me is the custom apps and some other options only the options which are available by default you can choose from them but that's completely okay not many custom rooms provide you this kind of things as you can see you can also choose custom clocks here for example if i choose fluid os style this is how the ui is looking like so this is looking quite um, impressive here and i think so you will also love this thing also the default launcher which was already autos launcher it's also now changed i mean some of the features new features are added some things are fixed for example the themed icons option is there you can choose the disabled or default and also choose the custom themed icons i mean if you want to try out lawn icons or any other themed icon pack you can choose that icon pack option is already there you can apply any third party icon icon pack from the google play store some home screen options are similar as compared to the previous update app drawer also has similar kind of things as compared to the previous update which i already shown you and recent panel a lot of users actually look out for the recent panel the recent panel look good i will show you later on as you can see hidden and protected apps feature is also not missing so these interesting features are already included some of the ui changes are there some of the things are changed with the ui everything else is just similar here if you take a look at the recent panel here you can see the clear all button is at the top and at the bottom we have some shortcuts available for example some quick actions you can say moving on to the other options here island notification was already there with this new update some of the features i mean some of the things are changed or some of the apps are updated with this are integrated with this contacts messages etc so more app support for this island notification i'm not exactly sure how many of you use this thing but it's available so i just wanted to let you know 
Moving into the miscellaneous options, you will see some spoofing options are still present here, like swipe to screenshot, Netflix spoofing, but you can see we have enabled GMS spoof options available, which means you can see spoof your device to pass Google Play attestation and the quick switch is missing from here. If you remember, if you watched my previous video, Rising OS came with Nothing OS launcher, but for now, while making this video with this new update, Nothing OS launcher is dropped and maybe with just upcoming days, you will get Nothing Nothing launcher back again because this is a major update this is based on qpr2 a lot of custom rooms are actually giving you some features less features so that might be included with the new update but for example for now it's not there so i just wanted to let you know having a look at all the features here you already know this brings you some very useful features and customizations for example, lock screen has a lock screen clock styles and some gesture options are there. We also have some fingerprint customizations and in the theming section, you have the option for custom fonts. For example, the font picker is also quite interesting one. Not every custom room brings you this one. I guess Matrix OS is one of them, which is bringing you almost similar kind of customizations. Although this rising UI main focus is on the UI changes as far as I know, because if you take a look at the customizations, most of the customizations and features are present in some other custom rooms too. But in the terms of UI, there are many UI changes available, even in the setting style, even in uh, some UI changes everywhere you can see the cloned apps feature is also present here although not every app can be cloned but this can be unlocked very easily by just installing a pixel expert magic module and you will be able to unlock or you will be able to clone all the supported apps or basically all the apps which you have installed on your device and if you take a look at the more security and privacy options you can see app locker is also not missing it is available there you can choose and install this thing Right now, while making this video, it's available for some of the all officially supported devices. If your device supports official version, check it out. The support group link is already available in the description. If you want to know more, I mean, uh, if it is working fine for your device, if it is having any bugs or etc., definitely there is a support group just for these. So you can check it out in case you want to. I will provide you the link in the description for all the official supported devices, basically a support channel or support group. So you can update channel, basically. You can check out and find out if it is available for your device or you can also check out your device community group for more information. This is all. Thanks for watching. And yes, I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.